If you're visiting my website for the very first time, you may notice that there are hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of training videos on this website. I've gone through excruciating detail to make sure that every possible topic from an exam is covered with videos on this website. So a common question that comes up is, can I take my exam just by watching these videos? Is this everything that I would ever need to know? And the answer is a little bit yes and a little bit no. As I mentioned, every topic is listed in the exam requirements that you can download. If you're watching a CompTIA certification exam series, then you want to be sure to download the certification requirements at bit.ly slash exam objectives. Some people have sent me emails and said, I've watched the videos, and I've taken the exam, and I passed it. I didn't use any other resources to be able to do that. And if your background is relatively strong with these particular topics for this exam, for A+, plus or for Network+, plus or for for Security Plus, then it probably makes sense. You can watch the videos, get a feel for what will be asked of you, and then take the exam. But I don't personally recommend doing this, primarily because there are so many other resources available to you, things that are very inexpensive, like books. You can find a lot of great detail in a book. Making a video allows me to get some topics across in a visual form, but obviously a book is going to provide a lot more detail that's written right into the text itself. And in many cases, it doesn't cost anything at all. You can go to the library. You can check a book out that's going to provide you everything you need to know for that exam and use both the book and the video. I feel that I learn in different ways through different media. There's some things I can pick up very easily in a video and some things I can pick up better if I read about them in a book. And that might be the same for you as well. Don't miss an opportunity to use every possible resource available to you. Also keep in mind, these exams cost money, and they're not at all inexpensive. If you fail an exam, you have to pay to take the exam again. So you want to be sure when you walk in the door for that exam that you understand exactly what will be asked of you, and you've been able to study every possible resource. That way, when you sit down to take that exam, you know that you've covered the bases and you've studied through every possible topic from everything that's available to you.